Holy shit. Look, he's probably, look, he's smiling. <laughs> what the? humans i'm currently at mount airy casino resort in pennsylvania about a two hour drive up here today is wednesday happy absolute crank the vibes and speculations day but pretty much going to be chilling with gustafins never really see gus too often just because he lives pretty deep up here in pa so uh him and i are going to be spending the day over here at mount airy he hooked it up with some massages we got a little pool day go a little bit of bottle service and a cabana. We got dinner tonight. So I don't know if I'm gonna be staying the night here or I'm gonna be heading back home. Don't really know yet, but today we're obviously gonna be cranking the vibes for a little bit. Figured I would bring the vlogaroni around. Figured I'd bring the vlog along. Gustavros back on the film. See what his vibes are. Haven't seen Gus in... There's no way the last time I saw Gus was New Mexico, but I feel like there's a really strong chance that that's the case. There's no way. I'm just looking through some of my pictures because I like to take pictures of Gustafins. I think the last time I saw Gus was literally New Mexico, dude. This is crazy. Absolutely shredding the slopes, even though we thought he was gonna absolutely pass away on the lift with all his asthma. Just wheezing at least 90% of the time. And then the funnier part is, actually the thing that was keeping him alive, he ended up losing on the mountain. Chain of events. I lost my phone, ended up getting it back. Shout out to the good Samaritan for absolutely cranking the vibes out in Taos, New Mexico. Definitely stoked to get back this year. Hopefully we got some pal again. We definitely uh, got super lucky last year. So we'll see what happens. All right, people, waiting for Gustavros to pull up. And then uh, we're gonna start the day, probably just chill by the pool for a little bit, go get a massage in a couple hours. Pretty tough day, but here we go. Oh, so much nicer out here. Dude, I love that. Special treatment, dude. Wow. Gustavros walks in at Mount Airy, treated like absolute royalty. Yeah, it'll be the fourth one, I think she said, so. Dose. I think it'll be this one. Trace? Yeah. One, two, three, four. Sick, dude. Humble abode. Just a normal Wednesday? Just a normal Wednesday, bro. <laughs> so sick. Honestly, oh. I'm so down to just take a nap at some point, too, dude. Feels good to get off the feet. I honestly was, like, sore. I've been that, like, every day at work. You don't realize, bro, like... What's oh. good? Can I get that sweater? Welcome to absolutely not. Okay. Did you film any of this this morning? No, but I'm filming you. Welcome to the vlogs, people. Hey. Hey, vlog. Yeah, I want to give a speculation. Of this bus? Yeah. Bizarre. 
Can we hear it, Jeff? I'm so excited. I don't know what it's supposed to look like. I thought he was joking. Hopefully it's a short bus because I don't want it to be too big. This is crazy. We just had this meeting yesterday. I know. And I I think we all collectively said, maybe we can get a bus, maybe we can. And he was like, oh, we'll get a bus. And I, at the end of the meeting, I was like, Nico, if you can't get a bus, it's really okay. Like, don't, I don't want too much pressure on you. He looks at me in my eyeballs and he goes, I'll get a bus. <laughs> Holy shit. Look, he's probably, look, he's smiling. <laughs> what the? There's no fucking way. It just broke. The bulls just came out, dude. Come on. Come on in. Wow. There was never a plan B. Let's go, baby. Tommy, this is my girlfriend, Gab. Hi. Bought a bus. <laughs> we bought a bus. And honestly, if you don't count the hours we were sleeping, it took him about six hours. <laughs> Dude, it looks, it's actually in good shape. Yeah. This thing's a cream puff. I love this. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm going to be able to open up the door. This could be any better for that. I didn't want to tell him that. I said, you know, not for nothing, these doors, I, you know, I was looking for a regular door. This is a little <laughs> This door's all f***ed up. <laughs> Four grand out of the question. There you go. Oh, oh, what do you say? Yeah, was, the guy was Jamaican. So why don't you give us your best Jamaican accent? You're on the road to getting canceled anyway. <laughs> $4,800, you got a deal. I said, T, how much product you got in the car? <laughs> $4,800 in a case of coke. Case actually cost me probably 50 bucks. <laughs> We're like, this is expensive stuff. We're like, yeah, 23, yeah, yeah 200. Yeah, this is about $25 a four pack. This thing's sweet. I can't even Look at this, bro. The job. windows are tinted. Check the tinted windows. I oh. just. Right. <laughs> oh, I have an F450. Now I got an E450. Okay. Can I buy a vowel? Uh, e. Ding. <laughs> I'm just the one thing I'm really upset about is it doesn't have a stop sign. So, but the power is here. Oh, oh, a stop sign good. that opens up. We're gonna get a sign. It says, up. "Let's get." I can't believe this. Bus, and he legitimately would drive around. Nothing surprises me at this point. Honestly, same. <laughs> it's so ridiculous. Too. It's like it's kind of like concerningly easy to buy a school bus, and I feel like. People worry about a lot of things, but like Nico yeah. behind the wheel of a car, arguably be more dangerous than Nico with a handgun. <laughs> have you ever driven a bus before? No, but I have a 75 Caddy. It's pretty big. <laughs> it honestly pisses me off how good the footage looks right now. <laughs> What's going on, everybody? Uh, just wanted to give a quick shout out to Goose Defense. Goose, if you're watching, super sick, chilling with you, dude, and. Uh, I really appreciate the time that we got to spend together in Mount Airy. Definitely super fun, and uh, thanks for having me, dude. That was super cool. Hope to see you again pretty soon. Just wanted to hop on here real fast. Quick PSA, all super positive stuff going on. Over the last few videos, I was kind of thinking about something, and uh, I just want to mention it to you guys, too. Basically, for the next, like, probably few months of the videos, I'm basically going to be doing a little bit of a bi-weekly video drop. So instead of every single Monday, I'm actually going to be posting videos every other Monday. And there really isn't too crazy of a reason why I am doing this, but um, I personally feel that my videos and the quality could be a little bit better. And I think that they could be a little bit more action packed. So obviously the videos are going to stay pretty short. Um, but personally, I just think that I can definitely up the quality, even just the quality of the content as well. Um, so obviously like the video in general, and then whether it's like surfing, wakeboarding, like whatever we end up doing, I think I definitely need to go ahead and have two weeks to really go ahead and fulfill that content. The reason for this is because I have just been extremely busy with work in such a positive way. And obviously I don't want it to slow down. It's actually crazy because, uh, you know, peak season, obviously, um, going out selling t-shirts we're providing for all of our surf shops stuff like that i was under the impression that our peak season actually passed and it only seems like that we're getting busier which is obviously huge and i'm super happy about that At the end of the day i definitely want to provide the highest quality content and i definitely want it to be worth it um, for you guys to check out the videos and almost like I want to just up myself I think the consistency is really important on YouTube um, But I think that the quality is actually a little bit more important than the consistency aspect So for the future and the next couple months going forward I'm definitely gonna try it out and just do every other Monday just so I can actually increase that quality 
take a little bit more time into the YouTube videos and obviously go out, shoot, and really be comfortable with what I'm putting out. The past couple videos I obviously liked, but I know for a fact that they could be better, which is why I think I wanna give myself an extra week to actually put out a video for you guys. So it's gonna be two videos every month, and then I don't really know how long that's going to last for, but if I have enough content and I'm comfortable with putting out a video for you guys, obviously then I'll just go and post on that Monday. So you guys will actually have a, a video every week, but for a little bit, I definitely wanna take that by week almost, just so I can actually structure the video properly the way I want it to and be comfortable and like happy with what I'm putting out. The last couple videos we put out, um, I mean, I was happy with them, but I know for a fact that they could definitely be better. And again, I just wanna be able to take the time to actually create the content for you guys, sit on the computer and make a quality video for you guys to check out. Those past videos that I put out, maybe like, you know, this past month or even like the past two months have just felt very rushed. Um, and it definitely was not some of my best work at all, which is why I definitely want to spice that up a little bit in the quality of the videos. You guys can bear with me, definitely working on some stuff. It's positive that work has definitely been super busy recently, but you know, at the end of the day, YouTube is a full-time job for people. Um, and you know, going out, getting the content, editing the content, it's definitely a bit time consuming. Um, but I know for a fact that I can up the quality of all of this if I were to just give myself an extra week. So again, two videos every month and we'll see how that goes. I love making these videos, especially for the entire process. You know, you guys have been here for literally the very start of the company and it's already super weird to go back and watch some of those videos in the beginning, even though it's only been a couple of years, but just for laughs, I'm also gonna put my very first video at the end of this one. It's so funny because you could really tell how uncomfortable I really was on camera. Um, telling you guys that I'm gonna go start this t-shirt business, had no idea what I was talking about. And uh, you know, fast forward two, three years down the road and we're still making this dream happen. So if you guys have made it to the end of the video, I really appreciate it. Eastwavesco.com, bunch of new arrivals on the websites, especially the hats, go check them out. Again, no video this Monday coming up. We're gonna jump to the following Monday, which is no video the fourth. But we're gonna be back on the 11th. We'll be back cranking the speculations for you guys and hopefully we have a pretty action-packed video. And again, I could just focus a little bit more time and effort into it. It's a positive that we are as busy as we are right now and I definitely wanna keep that going. Videos aren't gonna stop. If anything, this is only gonna make them better. So thanks for watching guys. Hope you enjoy. Shout out Gus again for uh, bringing me to Mount Airy. Super fun time, dude. And Nico, you're an absolute psychopath, so. <laughs> See you guys in the next one.